Well, good afternoon and welcome to Hobgarten by Winlatter. It's Tuesday the 15th of May 2018 and welcome return to John from his holiday. He looks 10 years younger with his new haircut <laughs> and he's got a suntan and he's been to Scotland. How is that possible? <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> so today we're going to go up Ladyside Pike. A bit of steep trek to it, but it should be a good walk. Ladyside Pike is a fell which should have been chosen by Alfred Wainwright, but his thinking was really stupid at the time because he, he chose Mungrisdale Common. We'll say nothing about that. So, anyway, let's crack on. Right, we walked about a mile now up and through the forest. Um, there's a sty here and it goes right up onto the top there, but John's suggesting we go around the corner through the trees, another forest to yes, get through. But this area is quite boggy, so we'll cut, cut through the trees and get up another way. But uh, yeah, it's got out really nice now, proper nice. Not much wind down here, mm -hmm. so it's quite, it's quite warm. Maybe the Factor 50 is going to have to come on shortly. You never know. We crack on. Well here we are, we've come through the trees now and it's a nice little steep bit up. This, to this little sty. We pan round, look at that, top of Winlatter. Beautiful. Broomfell, where we camped last year in background. Lovely like. You all right, Maddie? It's a nice steep walk up against this wall now up at that ridge so this is the toughest part at walk now there's sweat on my day huh? oh christ now you go there oh this is well steep well steep mother look at that hell Whew. And there's top there. Oh. Once we get into the ridge, it should be a bit easier. Well, this is proper steep. I'll tell you some of the some blue, blueberries, blueberries we call them, West Cumbria. There'll be millions of them once they ripen on here. Millions. Oh. If you want to pick them, you'll have to come up steep to get them. That is just stunning. It's afternoon. Okay. Right, onwards and upwards. Well, we've made it to the top of the gate here, from that really steep bit. Uh, it looks quite straightforward now. Penny, come over here, lass. Penny, <whistles> come on. Views are great. But John's just came up with a sly confession. There's a path here, and <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Easier. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> Test the fitness after a week on the drink. Aye, and it's a damn good climb up there. It does look a damn sight easier that way, I like, but yeah. Well, let's crack on. Well, we're crossing the top now. So as I come round, the wind's got up a little bit, but that's to be expected the higher you go. Bad views. More cloud now. John reckons it's rain forecast later. Hope not, because I'm going to go. <laughs> not too far at the top. I'm just having a rest. Well, this is Ladyside Pike, the summit. I've got. I've just put my bag down here. John's just making his own way up behind. This is a nice sheltered spot. But once I just get up here now. It uh, gets a bit windy. Bad views, guys, the old pike. Oh, get ahead in front of us. Bit of a ridge. White side. Up garden. Fair drop down there. So There's a decent ridge walk, but 
I don't fancy that scramble to the top. So, I don't know where John's at. Better go and find him. down here. Here he comes. Alright Mara. It's a couple of nice little coves there. Eh? You can get sheltered. As you can see it's a cracking view from here. Cracking view. Now the cracking view turns to an awful view when we eat it. Not bad, I was up at half five this morning with that tent. Well done, Mary. Well, we've had a nice bite to eat. There, a couple of pies and a bit of cake. Rejuvenated again now, so just panning round the bottom of Obgarten here. I'm just wondering if there's an area you can get a tent right down the bottom, a bit like along the track. Might be a flat bit. No, I'll say if you're stuck, you could definitely get in this pit. Hey, eh, John? Okay. Uh, quite sheltered. Can you you up there then, Mark? No, I think I'm going to wince out of that, like. No, I don't fancy that. No, Not too today. Much with two dogs. Uh, well, yeah, maybe. Two years since you were up there, isn't it? Three. Three. Four. 2014. Since we last up, right side. That day. Clouds coming off an hour, like. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's a that's a good ridge walk, right? It's a really good walk when you get on top, though, isn't it? We've reached a tree line now, come down this steep bit, quite uh, thick in it mm. to say the least. And there's the top. It's tree line, it's still quite steep down there to the next track, so we're going to walk down there. So that's Ob Garden, it's quite nice valley when you get down to it, looking up. Uh, well out the wind, lovely. And you know what's on it? There's not many midges about, no. thankfully. There's one or two there, but that's in the trees. So hopefully we'll stay midge free for the year. Uh, no, yes. surely not. Yes. No. Yes. All right, man. Well, that's us back. It's a good walk, about what was it, five point something miles. Five and a half miles. Suddenly enjoyed that. Good afternoon's walking. Yep. So weather's just got in now, so could rain in the next hour. It's proper dulled over. It's been just right. Yeah. And I've not got sunburned. No <laughs> factor fifty on nothing. So. That does not yeah. been too much. Just a nice exercise. Yeah. Just to get us down. So we're seeing a little wild camping spot potentially. So we might be back soon to do it. But uh, we'll have to wait and see. Mark got very excited. Easily pleased, easily pleased. <laughs> so from Fanny Boy to the. See you up next year. <laughs>